Hey everyone, a lot of developers use the CSS framework Bootstrap and it's probably the most popular one out there but a framework that doesn't get a lot of attention is Materialize also known as Materialize CSS and it's based on the Google Material Design and let me try and explain the main concepts of material design in about one minute. Material design is a design philosophy. Some might even call it a science. And what it basically does is try to replicate how a user interface should work if it was made out of physical material. Um, if I had to boil it down to three words, it would be visual and motion user guidelines. Actually, that's more than three words, but whatever. Every element should have a z-depth. And a z-depth is basically a box shadow which shows how much an element is raised on a screen. The goal was to move away from flat design and go beyond the x and the y axis to make the elements look more like real world elements. The goal is to be as user friendly as possible. And responsive in order to guide the focus of users and provide hints at what will happen and to give feedback with transitions and animations. Okay, enough with the design philosophy. Let's start actually comparing these guys side by side. So they both have grid systems and they both use 12 units per row with different class uh, name usage. They both have components with good documentation and examples showing how the components are used. They both need jQuery in order for their JavaScript files to work. They both have a mobile friendly navbar with a slightly different look in how they reveal the navigation items. They both give you the option to use SAS and they both allow you to use whatever component a few things that I found in Materialize that, in my opinion, make it a better framework is the usage of colors. It's so simple to add a color class, and if you want to change it, if you want it to be darker, all you gotta do is add darker and the level of darkness. You want to darken one to have the light darkness, or darken two, three, four, or five. And if you want to go lighter, it's the same thing. Another thing that I like is the flow text class not only does it change the font size uh, when your browser is smaller, but it also changes the line height. And another thing is, we all know Materialize is about animations. Uh, the scroll fire uh, component is a great example of that. And you would need an animation library if you wanted to add that to Bootstrap. 